Bitcoin, we start with one hour chart. Okay, first of all, uh, if you refer to my last video for the Bitcoin, we mentioned we had this one, we mentioned that this one can either give us an up move or down move. That's why we mentioned if you want to look for buy there, we put the target for buy here, for sell, we put here. Okay, because we see, when we see this kind of the move within the triangle, and either we can give us, and as you can see, the price drop. But now we see the price not moving really fast and almost the price take this low. Okay, if we see the price almost take and couldn't break, this is what we can see. Okay, now the thing is, we were expecting the price to drop and drop a bit more. Okay, but no, anyone getting a trade with there by having in three below this or here, I think no, it's better to manage it because the way is moving is not really fast, okay? It's not really sharp. And even if we move to 15 minutes, the possibility this one turn to a small flag for one more drop is there, okay? But anyone is in the trade, I think it's better to at least, if they can move their stop loss to break even, if not, I think it's better for them to take over the trade because we have been talking about this correction and relative to this, the price break this low, almost break tech. You know, we wanna see whether we can get the reversal or not, okay? Now we start with uh, daily chart. Okay, if we move to daily chart, as we can see, based on daily chart, we have been within this correction, and this is what we can see here. The way it's dropping, it can give us a, we can expect for the reversal or bigger correction here. Okay, that's why now we wanna see whether we can get any opportunity for buy. Based on daily chart, if this, we get the correction here, really corrective, then we can expect for one move down, all right? The only thing is, whether we get a reversal or correction based on lower time frame, I mean the bigger correction, can we look for buy or not? And if we move to forward chart, okay, first of all, based on forward chart, if we can see the price, the price is slightly break this one, but couldn't continue as like tag. And if we refer, we put this one, this three relative to each other, if we really refer to MACD, we can see we have a divergence as well here. Okay, now the thing is, if you refer to our analysis, we have been putting this one in relative to this for flat, for one more drop. We were expecting what we have here, almost similar length to get here. At least we were expecting the price can drop to like 42 or 40, all right? Because of if we consider this one as a flat. But now the thing is, whether this one continue or not, we don't have any confirmation. The only things we know the price almost take this one if we get that, because we cannot look for sell. If we get any buy setup from here, we take it. Okay, whether this one move as a channel, drop down, or at least the price take this stop. All right, we see that's why in my analysis I mentioned as long as the price break the low, we can look for buy. But our expectation to buzz at least drop some more. All right, now we want to see whether we can get any buy setup or not. And if we move to one hour chart, okay. Based on one hour chart, again, if we put this one in relative to each other, if we refer to MACD, we will have a divergence as well here. Okay, that's mean if you get any buy, buy setup, this is what we will be more interested. In this case, anyone is in this cell from here, I think they should, as I mentioned, they should start to manage if they can move their stop loss to break even. If not, just take over the trade. They, they don't stay with the trade in case there is a reversal. And if this one drop a bit more, any reversal, we, look, we will be more interested even if the price reverse from here, okay? From, if we wanna trade, at least we need a sharp move. Like rather than that, we don't have any other option. Or in case after the price correct here, we get the sharp move. If we wanna have in three, the only thing is having in three above the stop. Rather than that, we don't have any other option, even if we move to 15 minutes. Okay, the way is moving. As I mentioned, still we can expect this one give us one move down. Okay, now the thing is, we don't have any trade setup, but we're looking, if we get the reversal, we will be uh, interested in the buy. But as I mentioned, we wanna see how deep this one can go. By the way, we just follow, if we see any sharp move, reversal with the flag, based on one hour or 15 minutes, we can buy, right now from what we have. And the another option is if you want to have entry and trip of this stuff. And we want the price tag and continue. Rather than that, we don't have any other option. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any trade setup, I will share. Thanks.